Welcome Anybody? to the Four Dudes on a Couch oh, with a Blanket God. podcast. Oh. Coming with, to you, coming with, to you live. With a blanket's kind of crazy. With a blanket. <laughs> Except for Gabe. Gabe doesn't have to. I don't, I don't get, trust get your hands. Under the blanket. Whoa, whoa. Join, Join, us. Us. <laughs> Join us under the blanket, Gabe. No. I don't throw away my truck. Wow. wow. All right. Well, we we're gonna, have someone doesn't want really to be part of this podcast. I know. Oh, we're yeah. going to go and start this. I'm Who are you? I'm a person. <laughs> what is your name, person? You gotta speak up. Yeah, yeah, you can say that. They know yeah. my name. You have a drawing. They know my first and last name. Oh, it's, yeah, they're not gonna dox you. Oh. They can't dox you like that. <laughs> they're trying to steal my social security number. <sighs> watching me. Um, Do I need All right, this is Tanner. This is Ford. All right. This one right here. This is. There's a giant shadow. Sit down. Sit down. Right. <laughs> this is Ford. Y'all know me. And. Uh, I'm Gabe. Sorry, I'm, I'm eating chips. Yeah, the man so. sucking his fingers is Gabe. Mm. Hey, yo, what? What, <laughs> <laughs> what an intro! Uh, it's fantastic. So, what? Is, what was the first thing you said you want to talk about? The first college experience, dude. College. What to? What to expect? What not to expect? Mm. How? How to get bitches? How to not? <laughs> Fair enough. I mean, we've made it a minute in, so we're chill. We're chill this time out. <laughs> Slowly slide now. Mm-hmm. We're fine until we, we can have get technical it. difficulties. Our sound guy sucks. Yeah, so sound, just, sound guy, aka me. We'll just hear like the sounds of my feet. All right, we're all crossing yeah. our arms, so I'm gonna pull one of these just so it doesn't look. Yeah, as get good. a little comfy. I got sunburn on me, so don't put your arms around me right now, bro. <laughs> I am a freaking. I am. <laughs> I am baked right now. Sand is the definition of a tomato. <laughs> there we go. Like what are we doing? <laughs> what are we doing with my legs? <laughs> I don't know. I can feel your leg hair, and I don't like it. <laughs> I'm sorry, bro. Have you considered what? Is it cheese? Who course? taught you how to set up audio? <laughs> Me. We like playing so much. That does excite. Hey, it's a lot better when I was overdosing on freaking. <laughs> <laughs> I was overdosing <laughs> on cough right, syrup. Right, yeah, you gotta explain yeah, go that. Ahead, go ahead. Yeah. Tell right, the whole if, story. If we're gonna right. talk about what college is like, the college, yeah. college is like so. Like the first week of class. <laughs> what the frick? <laughs> first week of <laughs> class, I'm sick as a dog. Basically coughing out my, my left lung, dying. I started writing my last will and testament. Um, Tanner's getting all of my college debt. Ben's getting my food, and Gabe gets my half of the couch. <laughs> now, l- let me preface this by he said, <laughs> by saying he goes, Gabe, <laughs> if I don't feel better by tomorrow, can you just end me now, please? Just kill me, please, Tanner. <laughs> Gabe, you get you get my half of the couch, and I told him, wait, you mean the couch I paid half for? Yes. Um, ben gets all of my food, is what t- <laughs> he said, because Ben needs to put some pounds on, and Tanner gets all of his debt for for whatever reason. For he college. Just, he, just said, he just said, screw you're, you. Man. You're at the bottom of the barrel. Tan- Tanner can afford it. It'll be fine. Yeah. Uh, what what I take? I took cough syrup. <laughs> <laughs> Mucinex, an, eight, eight, an 800 milligram ibuprofen. Is that for sure? Yeah. <laughs> oh my God. Uh, what else did I take? I took, I think I took a regular ibuprofen like two hours prior. So, dude, oh my gosh. Probably, that's why I probably felt so bad. Continue, continue, million, continue that story. By the way, in case y'all are thinking out there, like y'all are too quiet. If we're like midway in the green, you're fine. And anywhere higher than that's perfect. Great, got it. Cool. So, um. <laughs> Cool. Wait, wait. So, so moral of the story. More of the story. Moral of the don't story is let your parents give you your medicine. Whether they they live all the way, just tell them. Hey, what should I take? Like, because should I take Ford one of one of the measuring <laughs> the little plastic measuring cups, or like, should I take three? Or, like shots? Or should, uh, like just, shots? 
Dude, I was taking, I was taking shots of cough syrup. I was, like, I was feeling terrible. I had to. And I wish this was just a one-day thing, but I'm pretty sure it happened the very next day. I think it did, too. <laughs> yeah. That's yeah. Still, I about did it yeah, this morning, I but I stopped myself. Okay, but anyways, go, go, continue on with your story. So after you took the medicine. So you took the medicine, like, I started to feel better, but then it just hit me like I got red or like a train. And I started saying, Gabe, put me out of my misery. Just, just send me now. I'm, I'm ready to go. He I said, see a light in the tunnel. He said, hey, at least at least you'll get free tuition. <laughs> free tuition. I appreciate how that works. He Your said, roommate dies, deal. you get free tuition. Yeah. I mean, like. I hope so. If it, I, I'm pretty sure. <laughs> pretty sure it's Too like, bad. Too, too bad. <laughs> Suffer deal, through. Deal with it. I'm pretty sure it's if an academic building burns down, everyone gets a free degree. I'm pretty sure I looked that up sometime. So I was thinking the same premise, essentially. Are we looking it up? Mm-hmm. Oh my! Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, you're good. Keep your own story. So, <laughs> I was laying on my bed wanting to die. I'd take a melatonin on top of that. That that's another one I took. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I was popping pills. <laughs> that explains why you were talking like. Dude, oh, man. okay, okay, okay. So here's the thing: you can either they either give you straight A's or a 4.0 GPA if your roommate dies, and or free tuition. Dude, straight you A's. Want free I'll, tuition? Straight A's. I'll just rather, quit. Yeah, I was about to say I'd rather pay for straight. Dude, if I have a 4.0 tuition, I can go just about anywhere. Yeah. Very much. But where were we? Oh, yeah. Me, me overdosed on, on cough syrup <laughs> on laying in my bed on Tuesday night. Yeah. Second, so, sec, second day of class. Yes. Yeah, second day in. And me and Tanner get back from a walk. Because, you know, we're just that type of couple walking around. and uh, <laughs> That kind of roommate couple. So oh, yeah. Uh, we get back. Gabe stops us and is like, hey, Court's completely out of it right now. Yep. So what, is, what do I do as a good friend? I hook up my mic. <laughs> Put her right next to his face, right. and we start interrogating him. The, the best part was when he goes, "Yeah, uh, Finn's part of that what what that gay sorority ROTC." <laughs> yeah, <laughs> I'm apparently part of a gay sorority club now. Yep, uh, I'm a, I I barely <laughs> remember that one. I, I, about halfway through our little recording where we do, I regained consciousness and <laughs> realized what it was going on, so I just ran with it the best I could. That two, was two and a half hours of him looking at the window while trying to talk to us and pointing everywhere. And <laughs> so, I mean, he sounded high as a kite. I mean, he probably you had were a, high as a kite. He probably, he probably had a better time, time than any of us. <laughs> man. That, was, that was a great time. Yeah. Second day of class, Ed, I'm already <laughs> seeing, stuff, <laughs> seeing stuff on the walls. <laughs> I got a unicorn over there. Best part is, it's a dry campus. <laughs> oh, it's a dry dry campus. Like, uh, Dude, that's how, the, that's how them Christian colleges do, man. When you, when you, when you take a shot of cough syrup, just to have a good time. <laughs> oh, Any, uh, anything fun happen for you yet, Tanner? Uh, no, no. Not really. Dude, it's just going to be like the that. rock of our conversation. Dude, Tanner, <laughs> I know, you got I know. Yeah. Oh. This is a four-way conversation. <laughs> 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 this is a four-way conversation. That's, oh, gosh, that's, no. I'm playing footsie with the blanket right now. I mean, jeez. <laughs> no, all right. Let's just go. Wor- worst class. What's your worst class right now? <laughs> Good question. Uh, my worst class right now is my history class, just because it's boring. Mm-hmm. <coughs> I've got. <laughs> Sorry. I've got a professor that talks about as slow as Christmas comes. So. <laughs> whoa, 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 hold on. What was that? <laughs> I said he talks about as slow as Christmas makes its way to us. <laughs> Did you say slow as Christmas come? Yeah. No. <laughs> what the? <laughs> Ford, what are you hearing? I don't yeah, know. I st- are you I, still high? I, yeah. I'm not high. Like, I can't you... hear anything. Like, I what did suck you, at this What did you listening. take before this? Hmm? I said, what did you take I just took this? cough syrup today. Oh, my oh, gosh. Oh God. Only cough syrup. Not, not again. again. <laughs> not again. Hey, this time it said 10 milliliters, or was it liters? Ten- <laughs> liters? Who <laughs> says it's liters? milliliters? It's those little Dude. tiny cups on top of it. 10 liters? Oh my I God. said milliliters. What the, what, what, it's little ML. It says M- 10 ml, adult 16 plus. So I filled it up to that line, maybe a little over, <laughs> just in case. And I took that right before we just started. Just in case he didn't get to the yeah. right thing. Yeah. I was like, ah. Yeah, it would be fine. I mean, you give kids cough syrup, it'll knock them out for a couple hours. That's how you babysit well. I'm going to be honest. Um, <laughs> my, kid, my kids get annoying. I pop them a Benadryl. Dude, okay, that's like not what you're supposed to do. If your, kid, <laughs> if your, if your kids get annoyed, you're like, let me just drug them to sleep so I don't get to deal with them? Oh, my gosh. I've seen, I've seen, <laughs> dude. I've seen on Instagram this. Dude was like, yeah, whenever my kids are like being loud and stuff, I put on a movie. 
when I put it in Spanish and they can't understand yeah, I saw it, that. so then I tell them, oh, well, you're probably just tired, and then I put it on English as soon as they wake up, and I'm like, that's going to be me. No, that, that's, definitely, <laughs> that's definitely the move for that, mm-hmm. but like, just dr- drugging them to sleep because you don't want to deal with them? Where is oh, where this conversation you, gone? We're gaslight them into thinking that they're actually, like, you know, <laughs> sick. <laughs> Dude! <laughs> Unless you get those special kids where it's like, you know, they, like, get wired from Benadryl. They well, there's a weird. whole, like, movie about that. You know that, right? No. There's movie? a movie where this woman drugs uh, her daughter oh, yeah. to be, like, paralyzed because she yeah. doesn't want her to leave the oh, house. Oh, the Gypsy Rose one? It's called Run. Well, no, I want my kids to leave. Know. I just want them to be quiet. <laughs> that is... <laughs> that is the same concept. No, not really. Oh, God. You're going to be a terrible parent. Uh, you are going to be a I mean, I'm horrible great with parent. kids. I promise. He's a good parent. <laughs> 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 says, <laughs> says the guy who wants to drug their child to sleep what? because... Quote, they're being too loud. Uh-huh. Anything, I would rather take the Benadryl than give it to them, so then <laughs> I would be asked out. So then just going to be the non-existent father who goes one day to go get milk and doesn't return? Because, quote, yeah, I didn't want to go get Cheerwine and not come back. This little North Carolina boy. Fair enough, mm. fair enough. Mm-hmm. Like, That's another debate we need to have right now because me and Gabe have argued. Well, we can before. we can ask them because when this gets posted, I can like have a poll. I can have a poll for it. Right. Go ahead, go go ahead. Go, with your poll. Right. I know so I know where you're going with this. Vinegar based versus mustard based. Vinegar based. No. Yes. No. Mustard it, based barbecue sauce. Thank is you. Thirty times better. You yes. South Carolinians are just out of your freaking mind. You can't drive. Your roads suck. Your barbecue's not as good as ours. <laughs> I mean, Tanner, Tanner agrees with me. You have not had good barbecue. No, I, I have. To I tried good. that mustard crap. And it it's like great. Crap. No, it doesn't. It's, it's great. Like, I got to take you to a good place it's called Sweatman's. It's in Holly Hill. It's like a the, hole. Dude, that place is so good. Oh, you've been there? Yes. Hole in the wall you get place. The from us? <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. well, it's, it's called Sweatman's for a reason. Fair and I. But like fair hole in the wall. Fair and I. Fair and I. Fair and I. When was the last time you went there? Like a year ago. Okay, so when I went as a kid, so we'd come back from the Masters that, in Augusta, yeah. and we'd stop at Sweatman's on the way home, mm-hmm. and they would always, it was a all-you-could-eat buffet, but they would only give you one plate, and it was like one of the little <laughs> foam, <laughs> one of the foam plastic ones, <laughs> so you would right. literally have to pile on as much yeah, as you right. could, like you'd purposely, a whole yeah. half of the plate would be barbecue, a whole corner would be mac and cheese, and a whole corner would be banana pudding, and, you and you could stack it, you could put enough, you could put a <laughs> napkin on top, and like, Stack some rolls on it, maybe some green beans or something. <laughs> but it was fantastic. Sorry. And now, Tanner, now you Tanner's can saying some out of pocket crap right now. He said, I'm going to go get some of your special chocolates. Wow. <laughs> special chocolates? <laughs> he's, he's Dude, wonder, if you wonder why special. Ben has a blanket on, that's what. I'm going to do. We're going to take a small camera break. Go ahead, intermission. No, 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 just a small camera break. Y'all can keep talking. Oh. Wow. Is that. that so you're just leaving us two. That doesn't bode. I'm shaving chocolate over here. Give me that. You're shaving, shaving cho- chocolate. You're cutting yeah, chocolate? chocolate here is I'm just moving oh this. Oh my god. Oh. You're going to cut your finger off. Oh, or and so you might have. The, the next thing that we should probably talk about would be a fun experience that we've all had here. So like, what is something that has happened to you so far this semester that was like worth, worth noting? <laughs> are we still talking or are we all yeah, on a break? Yes, yes. No, 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 no. They just can't see us right now. Y'all are, y'all are still gonna keep talking. Because they can, they can very well hear you right now. Oh, hey, wow. Hey, you look black. They can't see us. Oh, okay. My God. Yeah, Tanner. I hope that didn't take that. Uh, oh, 100% we're take that so up. I didn't say something bad yet. <laughs> I don't want to get canceled. It was Tanner first. I didn't get canceled yet. Uh, well, I can always bleep it out. Because <laughs> <laughs> I've had to do it in the past. I'll just cut stuff so that people can't hear us. Three and a half. Oh, sorry. All right, I'm looking there you go. at. I'm looking. Again? Ah! Don't scream. Sorry. Work, work, it's not, right yeah. at my face. Same difference. I gotta and so that way they can hear us a little bit better. So that way we don't get to yell. Whoa. Sorry, I'm looking up oh. buying something on Facebook Marketplace. You're now. looking up what? Why? How to buy something on Facebook Marketplace. That angle's flimsy. Why? Because. That's what she said. It's fun. Holy crap. Look at that. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what was the question? So, fun ex- something fun yeah, experience. Or, or like something that like, we, something's already happened that's like worth noting. Considering we're two weeks in, I mean, there hasn't been well, that let's go. Let's go like all... What's your favorite? Through, throughout, like, my first year? Yeah, yeah, let's just Express do, like, your whole year. conversation. Oh, okay. So, just so you all know, he's leaving me next year. He's yeah, leaving yeah. me next year. No, he's no, leaving no. me in two years. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's leaving, he's leaving this, this year. year. I'm leaving. We're leaving in the next year. That's what I meant. And you are got one more after all of us. <laughs> you're going to be so alone. Loser. <laughs> hey, at least he is Dude, get an apartment off campus. Right? I'll just come live with y'all. How about that? How about that? Dude, you sleep on my couch. 
Yeah, I mean, honestly, though, honestly, though he bro, can't, he can't, couches he can't are so get a comfortable. Room. He'll just sleep on the couch. Dude, couches are so comfortable. Like, some couches, bro, I room. could sleep better in a, like, on a couch than Dude, a bed. Dude, you this one's comfortable? Bro. No, <laughs> no. This one, this one shoves a metal rod up your butt when you try and lay down. Because that's where you that's sit in the, the middle. That's not the last time he says that, either. <laughs> oh, okay. No, you were it home. was just me and you hey. last night, so let's your, not talk about your that. Your roommate was the one that wanted this couch from our room, so that's on him. Not yeah, me. you could have had the... What are you the lesbian doing? Couch. You have the lesbian The lesbian you, you, couch. Get your mic under control, please. I am. I'm just making sure that all of us control are heard. Control your mic, man. Okay. I'm sorry. So you don't, you don't know Brian. No. But y'all, y'all do. All right. Semi. So one of my favorite stories okay. from... Okay. Dang, that's so cute. <laughs> one of my favorite I'm stories from camera. my first year here was me and Jacob were watching... Season one of Andor, there was some episode that came out, right? Dude, Andor was kind of... Uh, yeah, I need to watch it. It was so it. good. What are you talking about? They have a second season, too. Oh, that's there? Yeah. It's okay. coming out. I watched, the, I watched the first season. Okay, next year. Yeah, you, gotta, you gotta get through it. But So we were watching it as it was coming out. So he was over in my room, and Brian had knocked on the door. And we were both sitting there, and we almost answered it. And Jacob goes, wait, what if we just hit? So it didn't seem like much, but I was like, all right, cool. So, like... We get out. I'm like hiding under my desk, like one of these right here. So I was like, I was like this under the desk, fetal position. And then he's like behind in my little like closet area or whatever. And so then my roommate at the time, he like opens the door, and Brian's like, "Hey, is Gabe and Jacob in there?" And he's like, "No, eight. <laughs> Actually, he talks more. No, he was not. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, like Forrest they, Gump. They are not. They're not there. <laughs> and he's like, he's like, okay, cool. Well, let them, let them know. Let them know whenever they, uh, whenever they get back. Let right. Know. He's like, all right. Shuts the door. We like come out after he walks off, and we're like laughing. We're like, okay, cool. We play the episode for like probably another two minutes, and then Brian calls Jacob, and Jacob's like, "I was like, answer." He's like, "Okay." So he answers it. Brian asks where he is. So then he runs back to his room because they like live right next door over in Quad One, and I was like, "Okay, well, what do I do?" So then I ran over. I knocked on the door, thinking Jacob's like in his room, and Brian's not there. The door opens, and Brian is standing there, and I was like, "Ah, oh, crap." So Brian's like, get in here right now. Get, get the F in here. And I was like, okay. So I get in there. He starts like interrogating us. He like threw me up against Jacob's bed. And he was like, like literally like That's shoved me against from something else. Which, my, by the way, That's he's a like, episode. Brian yeah. was like 250, maybe oh more. Gosh, I mean, so this is a big boy. Big, big dude. Hold up. I got a picture. This is a big dude. Let's show a picture. It's personal information. It's to him at least. Yeah. He's, he's, he's got he's to understand. Camera's way up there. This dude manhandle you. Hey, yeah, yeah you let this man fondle you. Uh, well, that's private, so, private activities. <laughs> like this was Brian our first year in the middle. There. Oh my god! So, he's a big boy. Actually, dude, that is a big. That dude. might have been a few days before this happened. It also. So, anyways, throws me up against the bed and he's like, "Gabe, where the f were y'all? I know y'all were together." He said, "I don't, I don't know what's happening." Oh wait, wait. Also, I have to preface this. Brian had the biggest anger issues then, and he had told us when we first met him. That he has passed out from anger multiple times. Oh so we that made it amazing. We were making it our goal at the time to make him pass out from anger. <laughs> <laughs> and so he starts screaming and stuff, and he's like, Where were y'all? He's like, I know y'all were together. He's like, I came by your room. He's like, Y'all weren't there. I saw Star Wars on, so I know y'all y'all had to be in hiding. He's like, there, there's only a few options. We just kept an eye. He's like, There's only a few options. Y'all, y'all were out with girls. You were you you had a girl or something. You're like talking to some girl. He's like, y'all work together. Y'all are freaking in your room having gay sex. I don't know what it is. He said, but someone's going to tell me what the F is going on right now. He said, or I'm going to pass out from anger. I am so pissed off right now. And he's like in the corner of the room over there. Like <laughs> He's like pointing at us, making sure we can't get out. And I look at Jacob and we like had this like telepathy moment where it was like, dude, it's going to happen. He's <laughs> going to pass out. So I was like, can you give, can you give us a moment to like discuss this in the bathroom? He's like, okay. So we go into the bathroom over there. We like lock the door, and we. I was like, "What do we do?" He's like, "I don't know." He's like, "Should we? Should we tell him?" And then I was like, "Wait, what if instead we just went out your suite mate's room?" <laughs> and he was yes. like, "He was like, yeah, I like that idea better." So we like unlock the door, and we like bolted, and he like opens up the door. He goes, "Get the f back here!" And literally, for the next like two two and a half hours, we are chased around campus. Um, we got into multiple car chases. We got in my car, and he was, like, driving around, chasing after us. We had, like, multiple people across campus involved in this. One girl, Anna, actually, he called her. 
And she told us later that he was on the phone driving looking for us because we were at that point on our feet. We jumped in the ditch in front of the in front of the. Dude, this uh, is like a movie. Yeah, yeah, so the ditch over there in front of the tennis court. And stuff, yeah. We jumped down there. By the way, it is a lot deeper at night than it looks because I jumped. At night? I, Does it get deeper? Well, well. <laughs> I misgaged what it was, and so I jumped. I was like, oh, it's fine. And then I was like, I'm still falling. <laughs> and, like, I was okay, but I hit that landing hard. And I was like, gosh, dang. So we're, like, hiding in this ditch. He's, like, looking for us. And he <laughs> called her, and he's like, when I see Gabe and Jacob, I'm going to effing hit him with this car. I'm going to run them over. I'm going to effing run them over. <laughs> and he's, he's doing all this, telling her on the phone. My legs were, like, burning. We had, like, driven all around campus. He's, like, chasing us. Um, he, at one point... Waited because he he hunted, so he was really he had a lot of patience, and so he at one point we did not find him for a while, and he well, all it does is it changes the game. So uh, like I'm just watching like the the bars. Sorry, mm-hmm. keep keep going, keep uh, going. Well, so at one point he sat outside on the picnic tables with quad one, <laughs> waiting for us for an hour. We'd been calling him, messing with them, and so we get over, and he goes, "I had been sitting outside of the quads for a whole." effing hour my phone is dead i am effing bored come back now and well, i am crying laughing at this and we finally like sneak back in his room and he almost like got over there so he starts like banging on the door and we're like we had the blinds goes and we like open the blinds and he we like call him and he was like looking at us and we're like, like, like pick up pick up and he picks up he's like what and we're like all right, we'll tell you what happened, but you got to promise not to get mad. <laughs> and he's like, just let me in and tell me. I was like, no. I said, we like the fact that this makes it feel like you're in prison and we're talking to you through a glass window. <laughs> and he was like, I'm going to kill you. I'm going to kill you. And so we were like, all right, I'll tell you what happened. <laughs> we said, so, yeah, we, we hid from you. We were watching Andor the whole time. He goes, no, no, you weren't. I was like, yeah, we were. It took like five minutes to convince him. And he was finally like, I knew it. I effing knew it. I'm going to kill you guys. And so that was like the whole thing. And we, we ran for a while, but that was like the most eventful night of like my fall semester here. That, that, and after winter break, we got gel guns and bust into his room through, through his sweet mate's room. And his sweet mate the whole time was like, get him, get him. Yeah, get him. And he comes out of his bed. He's shirtless. And we just like lit him up. And he's just the whole time. Just, boom, 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 boom. Titties like bouncing everywhere. <laughs> He had like all these like red marks all over him. He came, he came, he came back after Christmas break. <laughs> he came back after Christmas break, and he was like, he had one of those like huge gel gun rifles that like had like hard like big power. That junk hurt. But he told us originally I was going to buy a BB gun and shoot the crap out of you because I figure I'm gonna either go big or go home. And I was like, well, I'm glad you didn't. He's like, yeah, but I still went bigger. And I was like. It's fair. You won fair and square, but yeah, that was that was my that was my first year. Well, what about you? I didn't even know for it then. Shoot, I say my first year. Sad time. You remember the hurricane? Hold on, you oh, weren't even I do the hurricane. The hurricane. Uh, so we, we were which one? Here comes the hurricane. Oh my gosh, that one. That, that, that was awesome. So like they here's the thing about me with that hurricane. It was really weird. We originally got told to evacuate on like a yes, Tuesday. We did. Yes, we so did. like Tuesday, I spent five hours driving home because it was normally my ride home is like two and a half hours, give or take. It was five hours because everyone in Charleston yep. was heading upstate. Yep. Like Wait, going. For the record, that, do you no, want to give us your exact location? Right? No. Oh dang it. That was freshman year, right? Yeah, freshman year. Yeah, yeah. I remember that. It was like five hours driving back home. I drove home, and that night I had been scheduled a shift at my job, so oh, I worked it. Gosh. It was like a four-hour shift, and I worked it. But immediately after the whole shift, I was just like, "There's gonna be so much fun stuff going on at yeah. campus," and so that night, I like I got off shift at like ten o'clock at night. I drove back to Charleston. Oh my god! I didn't even hesitate. I just like had all my stuff still in my car. I like ra- my parents were out of con- out of sorry out of the state for some reason. I think they were going to like some um, conference for my dad's work, and someone was watching my brother and sister i took a plastic grocery bag i just loaded it with a bunch of stuff that i would need for like the hurricane yeah snacks and drinks and yeah. like um canned food for some reason hey. do you remember what hurricane this was uh was it which one was it it was one, our one of the many year. one of the many we've had it, uh, uh, just, it, just, it 21 21 okay yeah we get like three per year so yeah again, three, three to four per year fall october maybe no not october probably september of like 
2021. Uh, you know which one it was? He's looking oh it up right gosh, now. Gosh, there's a lot of names. It was probably Ian. Was it Ian in 2022? Maybe it was Ian. Oh, it was Ian. Yeah, was. yeah, yeah it was I was about to say, Ian was the one because, that I remember. Because it was originally going to hit straight towards the school, but it ended up hitting up. Because I, I, yeah. remember, I remember all the Instagram memes up. saying, Ian is going to whack our school, guys. Yeah. Yep. Dude, that was oh my gosh. Our I remember... I remember the power going out, and I saw everyone running down the hall. Oh, like, yeah. What's going on? Everyone was running out. And they had, how many people was it? Probably, you there? You were I was there, there. yeah. There. I was back they at had, that point. They had maybe six guys mm-hmm. running through, the, like, the ditch where the water was draining. Yeah. Sliding, catching footballs, and just diving into the water. Diving people, into people the ditch like, where rocks were. And yeah, and, and then, and then the on the field, <laughs> uh, with soccer players, <laughs> It was flooded, and people had like gosh dang surfboards, and they just skim across. Yeah, we body remember, we you, body surfed on the soccer yes. field. I remember that because yeah. we all uh, lined up in the line. But do you remember the the what was it, the canoe in the reflection pond? Well, that was last year. No, it happened <laughs> our freshman year. Oh, oh well, that the, happened last last year. That was Evan. He yeah, got last year. And to... <laughs> <laughs> yeah, last year. <laughs> when our friends Evan decided to kayak in our reflection pond in the middle during of our a campus hurricane. during a hurricane. He got a ticket for that, too. Did he really? Yeah. No, I thought, I thought, I thought they just took no, the kayak. They, they took the kayak. I just went they gave him a citation. I think he said no, he got a warning. He got a warning for that? Like, they, they said, they, put they, your kayak up, and if you do it again, you're you're getting a ticket, and we're taking the kayak. <laughs> and he was Golly. like, ah, I did what I wanted. <laughs> I was like, he, he made it famous on Instagram. So that is true. I forgot about that video. They were like, who is this kid? I was like, I know who it is. Yeah, it's like, it's like little Devino. I know who he is. Do you have any yeah. any fun stories? Uh, well, we were done with okay, the hurricane. Okay, okay, yeah, okay, yeah, gosh, okay, 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 okay. 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 It was like same time the power went out. Like I had my big speaker at the time. You remember that? We were playing. We wait. Hold up. Tonight. <laughs> we if it's not a dog, so if not, send me that video and I can just post it later. I can have it playing yeah. playing over. That was hilarious. <laughs> stuff. I think that was the one I was working that um, during that hurricane. Honestly, but I'm not, the, I, I, the same one freshman year, they were passing out sandbags in the quads to help put in front of doors. They were passing out sandbags. Yeah. I didn't even know about that. I remember that because I remember one of my <clears> friends <throat> I went to high school with. He was coming here. His name's Liam. Um, he had two sandbags in front of his door because they thought the quads were going to yeah. flood. And and they have in years past, <laughs> like last year during the hurricane. Did they really? I, yeah, because last some parts some, of it flooded. Uh, so some parts did because last year like. <clears throat> Two more doors down from this one, where I was. Um, me and my roommate literally rolled up my carpet and put it on top of my bed because there was water coming through a door. Yeah. Oh my gosh! Uh, our, uh, the room I was in didn't get flooded at all, Mm-mm. which was weird because I was like, "Oh gosh!" Because I, I, I was pulling it down. I was like, "Oh gosh, mm-hmm. my room's gonna be flooded. I have stuff on the floor." I was like, "What am I gonna do?" Because my fridge and everything was on the floor, and they didn't tell us to move it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they just assumed. And they're, they're like, "Oh yeah, it won't be that bad," but the flooding was the worst. Yeah. Cause I remember it was like all across like Charleston and Berkman County. There's a mm-hmm. bunch of flooding going on. Yeah, like people's homes were going on the water. This last one, that was the worst You're one. You talking about this one this year? Yeah, the one that like yeah. uh, about yeah. a month ago. Yeah, was that? Was that Debbie? Debbie, yeah. Yeah, yeah I was. No, I was little, little Debbie hit us. I was home, and I was curious how it was down here. Mm-hmm. But uh, yeah, there was a one lot. Of my, one of my managers lives on the coast, mm-hmm. so they drive two hours or two or three hours to and from work, and they ended up staying at the house at their house, which is on the beach. Mm-hmm. During that, and they said it wasn't that bad, but they did it have issues it was, with the car. It was long term because, like, it wasn't like a normal hurricane where it just comes through and it just no, dumps it rain. Just it was this steady rain, yes. like it was just like steady rain, and the water built up. See, my house isn't my house is no our most of our houses are nowhere near the coast. Mm-hmm. My house it rained for almost six days straight, like mm-hmm. would not stop. So sorry, this is really stuck no, in my head now. I'll be straight. I I zoned out. No, you're good. <laughs> I need this song to play. It's playing. Yeah, there we go. This is what's stuck in my head right now. Stop the hurricane, so weird. Before, did you know this happened to Liam? When yeah, I was, I was the one that sent that one in. <laughs> I was there. I was cutting his hair. Hold on, we got to show, show the photo. Show the photo. Oh. So, he, so no, oh. you can show it to the podcast. Yeah, so, so I'll uh, just get over it. So, backstory on this. That's my friend Liam that I was talking about earlier. Um, he had long, flowy hair, and that was like his defining feature. 
It's like all the <laughs> all, I, I, all the ladies uh, are like, oh my god, he's a freshman. He's got long flowy hair. He's from California. Ooh. He's from and, California. Yeah, he's from California. That makes so much sense. Yeah, well, for his dad, his dad's like really hard conservative. It's like served in the Navy. Is like big pro guns. So I was like, I never saw him living in California, but they were. But that that was second or third night here at college. I think it was like the. Are su- you serious? The, su- it was that? the Sunday before classes started, he wanted to do that. We literally went out to Walmart and Did bought he hate it. himself? No, his. Pa- was this your freshman year or sophomore year? Freshman. Okay. And Y'all did this your freshman year? Yeah, the Dude, day before the classes stuff started. That happened Hang on. Freshman year. I wish you were here. And Jesus. he still got a girlfriend. Did he? No. <laughs> Who? He him or no, Liam? No, he doesn't. Liam. No, no he, he doesn't. doesn't. Not anymore. He did get one. He did. He got a girlfriend after that. That was true. Dang. That's the crazy thing. Yeah. That girl's insane. Yeah, yeah. I know, I know. Oh, that's awkward. Yeah, that's <laughs> awkward. No, but like, he, it was the night before classes started. He's like, hey, let's get, like, <laughs> let's give myself a mullet. So like, we started, like, we were getting them on the sides, and it was lining up pretty bad. Until pretty all of a sudden, su- pretty bad. <laughs> until all of a sudden, we went up too far, and then we were like, we got to, <laughs> we got to do it all. And so that's why we did the little rat's tail in the back to make fun of them, and we shaved it all off. But here's the funny part. We had a guard on that whole time when we were shaving it, like the lowest guard on the whole time. And so we it looked pretty good. It was even. It was cool. But then, here's the worst part. We took the guard off. <laughs> hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Where's the photo? I need the photo again. Oh, uh, no. I need that post. Um, we took the guard off, and we were just touching it up because there's some high, some low. The guard didn't, like, do it completely the way it should have. And Liam was touching himself up. And I walk, I walk, oh, bad, hold up, hold up. He was, he was touching up, like, the hair and all that. Um, and all of a sudden, I was walking in from my room to get, like, a drink. I think I was grabbing, like, a Sprite or something. Oh, No, hold up, hold up, hold dude, up. Dude, oh, no. I got, uh, I got to find the photo. It's on my phone, sorry. Um, he was touching, he was touching up. I walked in my room. I heard, no, <laughs> no, and I, I knew exactly what must have happened. He had taken the guard off, and he had he had buzzed it a little section of his hair, oh. and it looked hilarious. <laughs> like, we lost it. We were like, this is too good. Oh, no. Oh, oh man. That would only okay. happen to Liam. Okay, so uh, is, this, is this your story? Hold up, I gotta find it. Ah, there it is. That's what happened. He buzzed his hair. Right, sure he buzzed like... that one spot, and we're like, "All right, we gotta go bald. We have to go bald. There's no other, the no other option." Did like, he go bald? No, he went back home, and like his mom did it professionally. Right he, his mom did it professionally, like evened it out. But for the, he was wearing a toboggan in 90 degree heat in Charleston because he could. Wait, that's why he was always wearing. That's why he was wearing a toboggan. <laughs> it was, it was so hilarious. Weird. So our math, our, we had met our math teacher like that Friday for orientation or something, and she knew that he had long hair. He walked in class Monday morning. She was like, Liam, why are you wearing a hoodie? Where's, where's, where's your hair? He took it off. The whole math class lost it. Like everyone was like, oh no. He, I don't think he took that hoodie, um, that little toboggan off for a month. I wouldn't have taken it At off least. to start with. And, and he's still got a girlfriend out of it, and I think that. All right, we gotta talk about how he got that girlfriend too. <laughs> okay. okay, we're on a rant now. Wait, we're just talking wait, about wait, wait. Him. Pause. Do you have a story from that you can think of? Uh, the only one I can think of off the top of my head is the one from the. So the one that's already said. Yeah, the hurricane. Okay, okay. Because yeah. me and Ford right, were could, both there. Yeah, yeah, we were both okay, there. Okay, okay. All right, so this dude and I, I, I'm probably gonna have to try this strategy. This is how I'm gonna have to get a girl at this okay, point. Yeah. Okay, but well. we were. It was like first, wait a first or second. Trying to get a girl. Yes. <laughs> Dude, I need a girlfriend yes. for real. Yes, <laughs> like, yes. of course. Of course. But it was like the second or <laughs> second or third day of class. <laughs> we're in we're in the calf, um, eating dinner, and there's these two girls that like had hung out with Liam during like the orientation <laughs> stuff. They were they were twins. That's important. They were twins. Um, and he saw them. They were at a table next to us. And I like we never see them. Next yeah, no. Um, but he was at a table next to us, and he we said Liam. Are those two the girls that you were talking to earlier? And I was like, yeah, they're twins. There's two of them. And so, <laughs> why specifically two of them? Why specifically like two that? of them? Ooh. So we said, um, Liam. More for no, me. We said, Liam, no balls. You won't go over there and talk to him. This man, he's the most socially, like, not awkward, opposite of awkward. Like, he could give a rip. So if he's so an extrovert. Extrovert. <laughs> he, yeah, he could give a rip if he's embarrassed. He just gets straight up, walks over there, plops down in the middle of the two of them, in between the 
like in the seat in between Some the ladies, two. Some ladies, how are exactly, we? That's exactly what he did. No, he did not. Yes, he was like, hey, ladies, how are y'all? It started, like, flirting with them. And he got one of them, one of their numbers, and, like, that was his date to rock the boat after. Dang. And wow. I was like, that's the confidence I need to just walk up to a table full of girls and just say, hey, what's well, up, I mean, ladies? Our, our campus did just get an influx of a bunch of freshmen. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> all right, that's told, about all I the said, girls I told Gabe get. I'm probably not going to date freshmen. Yeah, I was about to say. I don't like the age difference. Like, if I'm going to graduate and you're here for another two years, I don't like those Three. Kind of... They're a freshman. <laughs> another three years after me, I don't, I don't know. Man, what's are smart. That's are smart. And they, I want someone who's going to graduate. Well, smart, I don't think you, that you left out the best part about Liam. Oh, that he would just walk into our room in underwear for, um, butt ass naked all the time? <laughs> it wasn't, was it that, wasn't Was underwear. that the best part? No, I, that was I, not the best part. It didn't happen when I was there, but, uh, <laughs> Logan, Logan talked about how he would just walk in and his sweet, <laughs> the other sweet mate would help him, <laughs> his other sweet mate would help him flash Logan. <laughs> and he would, like, be twirling around. Logan finally got tired of it. Took Brian's big old <laughs> gel gun thing. And while the oh. dude was butt naked, he had him in the closet. He was like, shoot him. He's like, you're not going to do it again. Are you? He's like, no, no. <laughs> oh, my god. Liam gosh. would always just, like, shout in that exact way. Like, no, no, no. <laughs> just randomly. And, like, you that dude play- sounds like Carl from a... Uh- <laughs> look, look, Jimmy Neutron. Door, yes. Bathroom doors nah. are closed. I would be laying in my bed in my little cubby I corner. Plug it off. And not. he would. Yeah, you are. Um, <laughs> I'd be in my little cubby corner. Doors, all cold. doors closed. And he would just be screaming at Fortnite. Okay. Or like Elden Ring. And he would like be losing. And I could hear him. Like, like we were in the same room screaming. Like, through all. Cement walls, doors <laughs> closed. And I was just like, I would like look at him like. I'm like, Ford, he died, didn't he? He's like, yep. <laughs> and I would text him. I text him. I say, Liam, shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that was my roommate last year. So, like, I'd be, like, trying to go to sleep. It's, like, 1 or 2 a.m. And bro would just be, like, playing video games talking to his friends. And dude would die. And all of a sudden, just as loud as he can, bro would just be like, dang it. And just start screaming. And bro has broken two controllers on campus. You mean he oh, wasn't me? Well, yeah, my roommate was also a furry last year. But y'all already knew that. <laughs> He's like, they're they're quite aware that. of this situation. Well, yeah, yeah. I, already, I already told them that. <laughs> oh my god, dude, dude, how can you be a furry on this campus? Like, you'd be bullied so hard. That's why nobody knew about it. <laughs> That's why he took out of the room. Yeah, basically. Well, I mean, he did. He did for classes. No. That's about it. <laughs> yeah. No. He didn't no, even bring the, food back. No, too. we got all the homeschooled kids on this campus. Gotcha. Like it, it's all the introverted homeschool kids. Hey, not as bad and as Liberty. Not not as bad as Liberty. Liberty's a lot more. Liberty's stuck in my head all night. Here Lib- comes a hurricane. Yeah, Liberty's, Liberty's got all those kids that like they don't understand how to even do a relationship, and they're dagging them like getting <laughs> just engaged with picture. them. Like, I need a picture a so I can do it in podcast. Yeah. Well, we're gonna have a better setup later. This was like just, lights and yeah, I've got background. more stuff. I just you need to order flags or something off the internet. We'll make this like our little yeah, like a little. Yeah. Ooh, like how Ooh. Sheldon Cooper does fun with flags. It could be like, have you not fun seen? With, fun, have you not fun seen? With game. You, can't, <laughs> you can't say it. You can't say it. Oh, <laughs> I, that, that, that was would, perfect. Oh my gosh! <laughs> I need someone. That? I need. I need someone to make me that flag, please. I have people make me stuff every once in a while. I need oh. someone to make me that flag. Oh, if you know what I said, I need you to make it for me. Oh gosh, dude. That's that really would hilarious. be some fantastic yeah, you, art. You need to get LED lights in here. That's what y'all need to do. Well, yeah. I have some lights. Well, I just you, need to put them more. You need to like put the ones up in the corners here. You need to do the girly little stringy lights so we know. <laughs> the fairy, really fairy lights? Touch. Yeah, yes. so we yes. are in touch with your homosexuality. Yeah, right. Hey, guys. Mm-hmm. Hey, boo. And we hey. need to get a bigger couch. That works, too. A what? A bigger couch. Wow. I could do some couch shopping Or for I it. could just move all of this into y'all's room when we do this. Uh, nah, we ain't got that much room. Y'all have a bigger couch. That's true, that's true, that's true. But, uh, but we have the bigger... No, we. I think me between me, <laughs> Jacob, and Logan, we have moved. Hang I've, on, hang on. Finish that sentence. <laughs> I'm sorry. What? I, I didn't. I don't know what, what happened. There. Anyways, yeah, anyways, keep the glitch. Going. Between me, Jacob, and Logan, I have moved eleven <laughs> couches since school started. Dang. Between putting them all, it benefits of being the friend with the truck is just everyone's like, hey, I gotta move a couch. Can you put it in the back of your truck? Even though, like, half of it's hanging out the back of my bed because I got a toolbox in there. I wish I had that benefit. You want to know what I get from my car? Yeah, you and your Mercedes. Yeah, you want to know what I get from my car? I get girls asking if they can have my number. That's what I get. And I have to turn them all down because I'm already taken. Oh. 
What wow. a problem to That's have. That's so bad. Like, can I borrow you? You know what? I don't get none of that because I drive a freaking 2005 Volvo S40. <laughs> <laughs> License plate number GX7 or something. Okay. It's got I'm like. Bar- I'm going borrow your car one day. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. If you want to, like, just go right around campus for like. Dude, 20, give me the key. No, not even. 15 minutes, bro, and I guarantee you someone's going to come up asking. Mm. I hate my Love life. it. I literally. That or get a Mustang. I hate my life. <laughs> <laughs> You got really sensual bring you, my bring, mic there. Just bring your dad's boat down here and you'll bring plenty of girls. <sighs> this, this is not an ASMR session. This is a podcast. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just like, yeah. And we got plastic bottles. Soothe them with the sounds. <laughs> you suck at this. <laughs> oh, dang. Dude, every once in a while when like, I'll like start drinking water, I'll turn my gain all the way up. I'll just like stick my like gullet like, right on the mic. <laughs> I'll just swallow really hard. <laughs> This Yay. is not turning into it. We are not doing ASMR. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways. I love Gabe ASMR. Uh, let's see. Anything that's happened to me that's been interesting or fun? Mm. <laughs> I don't know. Have you been um, abducted by uh, aliens? That hasn't involved women? Nothing. Um. Besides that. Actually, no. Like, I have I actually done anything? I think I'm just boring. I'll be yeah, honest, I didn't know you existed until, yeah, like, I was about until say, like, last, I, the last semester. I'm very extroverted, and I don't care about what people think, but, like... He's extroverted, he just doesn't show up. I just don't, <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, I also, like, I don't think me and you had any, like, thing that would have no. allowed us to see each other. Except for Tanner. <laughs> Tanner didn't... You didn't want to meet... Oh, well. That was so <laughs> cute. That's another thing that happened this semester. He got a secret lover. No. Um. Anyways, what? I think we got ten more minutes of content left before I'm I'm out of stuff to talk about. Well, I mean, what are we? What are we at now? Oh, we're already at an hour. At an hour, perfect. Hey, this has been great, guys. Forty minutes. 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 Forty minutes
ferocious. <laughs> like, like he's using all these like Bro's big like words. A poet. Well, yeah, he's using all these big words. I didn't even know he could use. I've known this kid like my his whole life. And then when it's anything else, he is like he's illiterate basically. <laughs> and so it's kind of funny seeing him like, ah, oh, you know, I'm gonna touch you in a motherly way. I'm gonna <laughs> gonna make a tan line of my uh, my junk on your backside. It's just like fondle your balls. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna. I'm, Oh, maybe it was fondle you in a motherly way is what he said. Again, whose mother is fondling yes. them? That's the real question. <laughs> I couldn't tell you, but... Why are you looking at me like that for? Nah, you know it, man. Something, something... Yeah, so... That, that, was, that was what reminded me of that. I don't remember what. Of course, mom does that. My mom's six feet under, bud. <laughs> no! Not actually. Not actually. <laughs> Not actually. Hold on. Ah! Okay. It's an intruder. No, it's probably a what, Jacob? It's Jacob. <laughs> I called it. He tried our door. Here, let me turn on the light. Dude, come join the podcast. Ah, here, come. Aha! Uh-huh. Right. Come join the podcast. We're, we're, we're recording right now. You gotta yeah, introduce yourself, though. Whoa, what? I've here. already talked about you and our Brian incident. What? Yeah, come sit oh, down. Which one? Don't touch the mic. Uh, the running from him. All right, y'all. Okay. This is an introduce yourself. Hi, guys. I'm Jacob. All right, cool. <laughs> so there's there's uh, no people to talk to. Okay. Yeah, well, because I'm not. They didn't want to do a live one this first time. They just wanted to do the recording. Yeah. Gotcha. Um, what is cool. your? Do you have a good Sword story lines. from Jacob college? Looks like a, a good. A yeah, yeah. Wow. I'm like. Wow. This is crazy. <laughs> yeah. Oh, the hi. camera's a glowing thing. Hi. But, camera. Well, I mean, I can make this glow too if you want. That's sick. But <laughs> the yeah, other like, the other button mutes it, so I wouldn't press that. Is it uh, <laughs> glow in any other way? Oh, hello. Oh, that one looked like a hey. like a bomb pop. Hey. Stay on target here. Yeah. Yeah. yeah that's 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 like a like. Freshman or er, freshman, sophomore, junior, senior college story, or you got a few of them. Go ahead. Yeah. Uh, okay. Okay. Stop. Ooh. <laughs> ooh. Oh man. Yeah. So. <laughs> He's like, oh, right. do I? <laughs> yeah. Let me think for a second. Ooh. You can say a few. Uh, yeah. So you're I remember our uh, <laughs> our. <laughs> Our freshman year, um, I remember we uh, somehow got to getting the Orbeez gel guns, um, and oh, that just is this, that is just this came the, back. Did you already tell where we got Brian? Oh, I was telling him when we got you. Oh, um, yeah, I oh, forgot yeah, about yeah. Okay, yeah. So, so we uh, you join? we um, <laughs> so we get the Orbeez guns. Um, this is uh, shoot. So um. Gabe was out somewhere doing something, and we were like, oh, man, we have to get Gabe with the Orbeez guns. So we go and knock on uh, his door freshman year, and he was rooming uh, with a guy named Aaron Hyatt. Shout out, Aaron Hyatt. Um, And Aaron was a G and let us into their room when Gabe was not there. Um, So so there's a video of it somewhere, but so – Oh, sorry. No, oh, we're going on the sorry random tangent. Keep going. No, you're good. Um, but so, uh, Gabe walks into his room. There's a video of it somewhere. But so Gabe walks into his room. My roommate is standing there, dual welding red lightsabers, in the middle of the room. Hey, can you move those? Yeah. Huh? Can you move those walls? They're just I love there the now. Paper towels. The paper towels. Well, that was there to hold up the mic earlier, but then this I fixed it. Gotcha. The paper towels. Yeah. Oh wait, can I have one? Uh, yeah, please. I guess. Yeah, if you want a paper towel, go for it. Here. Oh, this is huge. Look okay. At this. Can I like? Does it change my voice or anything? <laughs> no, <laughs> not at all. Shoot. Um, but so <clears throat> Gabe walks into the room. Somebody pushes Gabe down, um, like into a corner, <laughs> and we two people start shooting him with Orbeez guns. We're just like unloading our magazines, just like. Just like just shooting shooting on Gabe. nobody pushed me. I jumped. Oh, you jumped because I didn't know three other people were in the room with with the gel guns. I thought it was just Brian, so I started with, with the hit. swords. Yeah, and I was like, I'm gonna get hit by lightsabers. So I just saw like <laughs> massive gel gun and then two lightsabers. So I was like, well, maybe maybe they won't move around the bed if no. I just jump in the floor, and, and that's not it's a how grave it mistake. Uh, so we we shot up Gabe in his room. Um, and then, uh, then we left. Yeah, like shot my butt, shot me in the nuts. It, it wasn't fun. It hurt. My legs were like. It was awesome. I'll be real with you. It was great. <laughs> <laughs> I love how you have very different viewpoints on this story. 
Do you have any other interesting stories that oh, we've sat down? Or, like, like, maybe that you've heard or something like that? Besides, Ooh. like, the known one where Gavin had a threesome in his car, like, last year. Ah, uh, yeah. Wait, the, what? The yeah, known, you, didn't, you didn't hear about that? The known story. Yeah. <laughs> that is crazy. Yeah. <laughs> I thought y'all knew about that one. I've never heard yeah, that no, Yeah, this kid named Gavin had a threesome in his car last year. Who is Gavin? <laughs> I don't know, but according to uh, Shane, he's like, yeah, this kid named Gavin had a threesome in his car. That's crazy. In Wait, a parking well, lot. Like, it wasn't, like, a devil's threesome, right? What is the difference between a threesome and a devil's threesome? Please enlighten me here. Well, it's two, is this, is this I think, live? I think, first of no, all, no, no. Okay. <laughs> I think it was. I think it was two I've, women. I've, I've, I think it was two women. Okay, so that's a normal one. I, yeah. I've just noticed. From comedy, threesome. I've just noticed from a comedy sketch. The other one is guy, guy, girl. That is not a threesome, according to this comedy guy. He said that is gay sex and witness. <laughs> <laughs> that's crazy. So, that's as long as we clarify. All right. Anyways, go on. Normal threesome. Dude got, dude got stomached by my oh. statement. <laughs> I don't condone either. <laughs> let me, let me put that I don't out think there. any of us condone a threesome. That's okay, thank you. Or sex before That's marriage. Right, you're right, right, right. <laughs> Why would you just make <laughs> eye contact with the yeah, camera? You gotta look that? right. <laughs> it's like, like staring or at sex before marriage. marriage. Skull. <laughs> I kind of zoomed out. So uh, anyway, how do, we, how do we bring ourselves back? To yeah, yeah. So that's crazy. So, <laughs> the verse of the day. No, um, <laughs> <laughs> your size. Ah, uh, Rick. I don't know how to follow I threw that you, up. I threw you off off track with yeah. The... Um, ooh. <laughs> uh, oh, we. Uh, <laughs> so I'm gonna put a little buffering wheel like yeah. right next to your head when I edit <laughs> yeah. this. Um. Yeah. So. Uh, freshman year, again, um, my sweet mate, nope, uh, roommate and I have this mini fridge, right? And my roommate, uh, <laughs> loves working out, loves protein shakes. Um, he got like a half gallon of milk and put it in the fridge. Um, <laughs> of course, it spills everywhere, gets oh all God. over the fridge. Starts dude, that smelling, probably stank. Dude, it smelled so bad. So we, we grab cleaner, we grab wipes, we start cleaning it up. Um, still smells absolutely terrible once we're done cleaning it up. Um, but, you know, at least it's clean. There's not milk everywhere. And then we go about our day. So about 24 hours pass. And I'm walking around campus. And my roommate texts me. He says, hey, I think we made mustard gas in our dorm. <laughs> I said, what? He said, we used bleach cleaner oh, no. and ammonia wipes <laughs> to clean the fridge. I need you to come back to the dorm. Um, it turned out to be fine. We did not make... Mustard, mustard gas, gas in our dorm. Oh my gosh, I've been a bomb on accident before. But you, huh? <laughs> <laughs> so, so, <laughs> so me and my family, we go like rock digging when we get like oh, Uber, yeah, like like this. Uber bored, and so like we'll go to like Athens, Georgia, and we'll go like mining for rocks and stuff. Right. But the way you clean off like the dirt to get them like super shiny is you throw them in like a five gallon bucket. You just chuck all the rocks in there. And you mix. I don't know the chemicals now because my dad never told me. <laughs> but essentially, you mix a whole bunch of chemicals, and it like etches and purifies them. Right. But if you mix them with the wrong amount of chlorine mix in it, it causes it a combustion because you put a lid on it in order for it to like dissolve everything. Yeah. <laughs> you put the lid on it. An hour later, we hear this giant explosion in our backyard. We live out in the middle of nowhere, so like it's it's okay because we go shooting <laughs> in our backyard and stuff. Plus, then we hear this giant explosion in our backyard. We walk out there. The rocks are everywhere. The <laughs> leaves are eaten by this. The, the leaves are eaten by this acid, and we're the the bucket is in shreds. We're like, what the crap happened here? <laughs> like, it was just like shrapnel. Dude, like, no, literally, it was like a bomb. <laughs> it, was, it was literally a bomb, and then just like acid, like acid-eaten leaves, just uh, like a pile of dead leaves, just around the bucket. That's so awesome. <laughs> That's just are you? Cool. Yeah, no, give me a frozen grape right we now. We got them. I don't. I don't know if y'all have ever had these, but my roommate <laughs> puts these frozen grapes in our fridge and just offers them to us, and they sound like this. All the they sound like this. Can I go in too, Tanner? Don't don't shoot them. They don't oh. taste good. I was I was told I was told to suck them like a lollipop. He didn't give me that instruction. Suck them like the balls kid. you do. Whoa. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. No, you, you gotta tell him about the toilet. Come on, that one's too frozen. Oh, oh my gosh, guys. <laughs> you drop a break? Wait, yeah. Can I get another one, please? This one touched Gabe's thigh. Only my inner thigh. Okay. Um, again. Freshman year. Um, it was a wild, wild, lawless time. Uh, freshman year was. Um, so, in like... So, uh, my roommate and I weren't uh, really 
friends with our sweet mates freshman year mm -hmm. um and often <laughs> just had a lot of weird interactions with them kind of a, a universal I've got a story about freshman my. year experience oh, thank you that is actually so huge um i'll let it defrost <laughs> but um so um one day <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. I was um, gonna blow it up. Suck it. I was gonna just <laughs> like a vacuum bro. <laughs> Actually, I almost just sucked my right back in my. <laughs> <laughs> I went. <laughs> like swallow it like a piece of gum. Back to back your throat and come back up. <laughs> um. So Excuse in like, order. at like, I don't know, like halfway <laughs> through October, um. Fall of freshman year, our toilet just like stops working. Like <laughs> just, anytime, just quit. Like anytime we flushed it, it would overflow. It like just like completely kaput. And so we were like, crap. So we we um we put in a maintenance order. The guy comes and fixes it. Um, and it works for about three days. Goes straight back to Dude, doing it again. What are y'all like, putting in that thing? We're like, just oh my wait. gosh, just wait. So <laughs> oh no. So then um and I kid you it, not, his sweet mate would knock on my door like eight o'clock at night or something. He'd be like, Gabe, can I poop in your bathroom? And I'm like, yeah. Jacob, I would see him, and he'd be like walking around the campus. I'm like, what are you gonna do? Well, we're gonna go poop in the science building. We're like over yeah. at the student center. I'm like, why? He goes, well, I, I know where all the good bathrooms are now. He's like, so going to the science building. Yeah. It's nice. Had to, okay, had speaking about the oh, Winkle Hall's got some pretty nice ones. I guess. I'm a, I'm a big Ashby guy, but that's a that's a think, personal I don't preference. Think we make that good ones. There's like piss all over the place. Oh. That's all the <laughs> Not when I've been in there. Honestly, the science building is kind of gross, man. Because there's, there's no one in there. <laughs> that is and you true. have the nice echo. But. <laughs> the, but the lights got, turn off. You've got. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> like, had that happen before. Then, then you're just sitting there and you're just like. <laughs> it's just, terrible. No, no, it's just like <laughs> one so hand. That's all it is. It's so bad. <laughs> anyways. Yeah, um, anyways. But so, for the rest of the fall semester, my roommate and I, like, we'd, like, wake up get ready in the bathroom and then walk to like the music building or um <laughs> the the student center or the chapel just wherever we could go to the bathroom because oh it was like gosh. we kept putting in work orders they'd fix our toilet it would work for like three days and then it would go straight back to being kaput wouldn't stop wouldn't work at all <laughs> why are you saying kaput kaput um <laughs> but it, so then it just stopped working that's yeah that's the same sound as when his poop went in the water <laughs> exactly right? no. but um <laughs> So then we go home for Christmas break. We're like, surely they're going to fix our toilet. We get back. They have not fixed our toilet. We put in another work order. <laughs> Three days. But start, stops working again. And finally, my roommate, I don't know what he sent in the email to Res Life. <laughs> If you like don't he was like, toilet, yeah, he I was putting it on you. Yeah, he was like, like I like we we've called in multiple multiple service orders on it. It's still not working. Please come fix our toilet. Can you not rub your feet while looking at me? <laughs> That's weird. <Taylor. laughs> Mountain Dew. Um, Sponsor if you know. <laughs> um, like legally, I cannot say that. So well, that, I would love if they sponsored me. That'd be fantastic. <laughs> Please dude, sponsor you know me, Mountain Dew. I mean, awesome. I've ha I have other sponsors, but, like, not drinks. <laughs> I would love to get sponsored by Mountain Dew. Oh, my gosh. Don't sponsor me, bro. Anyways, <laughs> Do you want one? I have one in the fridge. No, because I'll be up all night, and I have an 8 a.m. Tastes like food. I'm up all night to the sun. <laughs> I'm up all bro, I swear I have autism. Same. <laughs> <laughs> you autistic viewers, this shout is out to the <laughs> Shout out to my homies with the extra chromie. That's wild. Can we say that? Yeah, <laughs> I can. Is that allowed? Yeah. That's crazy. I mean, I've not been TOS for calling my friend autistic, so I mean, I don't know why I can't say that. Anyways, continuing on. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh wait, okay. So. Oh, what's in my nose? <laughs> That's terrible. Tell me your story. <laughs> so, <laughs> he's dying. He's gone. <coughs> Wasted. <coughs> so you know, you know the ending of the story. But so, I walk in the dorm one day in like the middle of the day, and the door to our bathroom is open, and there's I don't know if I want to drink. There's a maintenance worker with up to about there on his <laughs> arm, like in our toilet. Oh and I was like, just like the people who give birth to cows. <laughs> 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 That's one way to look at it. Oh my god! I was like, "What do you do? Pull out a baby toilet?" I was like, "Hey!" He was like, "Hey, do you want to see the culprit?" 
And I was like, <laughs> yeah, so what, what has been that terrorizing us? statement. Fist deep in a toilet. Hey, you want to see the culprit? Want to see no, the not culprit? Fist deep. <laughs> elbow deep. He's like elbow deep in our toilet. He I pulls want to out. Drink, but I can't. He pulls out <laughs> a fully intact plastic calf knife. <laughs> <laughs> and it had like wait, it had like hair wait, and your, like crap on wait, it and stuff. How does did someone? I don't know. <laughs> did someone? Yeah, eat? yeah, we were like, we don't. <laughs> did someone like, eat a how calf did that knife? get in there? <laughs> and he was like, he was like, y'all been like eating on the toilet. It was like. No, like, <laughs> like, and then both of our sweet mates from the from the previous semester had one of them had dropped out and one of them had moved, and so like I don't know which one of them did it. <laughs> you know, then they deny it. One of them denied it, That's but crazy. like, you know, I'm just saying. The dude, the dude did it with malicious intent. You don't, you don't have you don't a plastic. Accidentally. Well, what if it came out as a uh, urethra or whatever? His, his, you mean his, his anus? His, his, his butthole? <laughs> urethra is his booty thing. hole? Yeah. Never mind. Isn't your, your yes. urethra the yes. dangly thing in the back of your throat? No, no that's your uvula. Your no. urethra is the female. I'm gonna be that's honest. The, I've yeah. never taken Sex anatomy, so. Podcast. No, hold on. What is the your your? your I it's, can't even say it anymore. No, it's it's no. Yeah, 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 yeah. That's what it is. The yeah. Dude, having a knife come out of that would hurt. Anyways. Oh, Depends on the knife, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Shut <No>. up! <laughs> so, so, anyways, no. continue. That's the that's the end of the story. Oh, okay. They're like, I guess like. <laughs> he was like, you gotta tell him what Nick said. Wait, what did Nick say? You texted him, and you're like, you sent him a picture of the knife, and you're like, look what I found, and he was like. What? Like what? <laughs> like what? <laughs> I guess if you're like the only like it's not permissible in any circumstance, but like if you're like eating a steak on the toilet, you know? You're, like eating a steak. Who's I don't know. Like a, you're like eating a three a steak to four star meal on the toilet. And you drop your knife in the toilet and you decide to just cut your losses, you know? Like that <laughs> Why would you just pick it up? Why would just you pick, pick it up? Right now, if I drop this in the toilet, I'm going for it. I don't care. Dude. So that was freshman year. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. Um, so anyways, that was uh, podcast one. We've not thought of a title for it yet. I hope you all enjoy More news on No, it's not. <laughs> yes. That's- uh, that's not the podcast name. And it's not yeah. four dudes on a couch all under a blanket either. Yeah. Because they um, were all under a blanket. Yeah. I was like, I don't want four's hands they, on me. They yeah. were? They, we were. I was not. They were? I was Four not. guys? Was not. Well, <laughs> that's what Ford wanted to name it. I was Anyways, not under that blanket. Thank that's you all my feet are this for cold. hopefully watching this. I hope this goes somewhere. Uh, and we will see you all <laughs> next time. And we're drag, accepting sponsors. You, yeah, it works. Ma- Mountain Dew, please sponsor me. Can you drag the mouse over to the blue button and click Yo, on Yo, Gabe's got his toes out. Yeah, just 